the Rek'Sai. Obviously knocked it, and she works really well into dive as well. You can either counter dive, or you can just put the paranoia down to stop the enemy from being able to dive into you. If Gragas puts an explosive cask in, and you pop the paranoia, Dragon down to 2,000. Bo now stepping in, TP invested by Finn towards the bottom lane, and Vitality see it, and call off any further play. It's nice timing from Mistralis. They knew both flashes were <laughs> just, just too difficult. Time. But upset, going to be managing getting a few plates on that bottom side as well. Now Photon immediately TPing back up. Far braver here. We'll have to see though, who he's going to collide with. U3 from Photon, just wide of Kobe. Bo here as well. Jonghun knocked back with Pathmaker, pulled back with the all out. And Vitality get another kill on the board. Still only level five, which means that he doesn't have access to that quickness. And the second dragon of the game will fall. Vitality get it. And they are in prime position to continue to close this one out. Obviously only 12 minutes in, and it's only a thousand gold lead, but the lead that Astralis needed to get in the early game has not materialized. So to do next after getting more gold over onto leader. There is a TP ward behind here, but it's only perks that has TP available for Vitality. So <laughs> TP from leader towards the mid lane. Rift out comes down. We'll charge through as well. It looks like Vitality giving up pressure on the Dragon, at least for the moment, to make sure that they could get that mid-tier one. Leader rooted up with the Tangle Barbs. Copy in 113 will take this. Photon in a flank position. That's a pretty powerful point to be at if they can get there before this next Drake. But it's also like, okay, we've just committed two people to bot side. Well, now we've actually got <laughs> What's more entertaining, the cheers mm -hmm. for killing Pink Wards or Perks getting caught? Stunned up, rooted up, lightning crash coming out the heartbreaker, but already the pop blossom for perks and the stopwatch buying so much time. Bo dives in. Copy untouched on the back line, but so's upset. Photon just stepping forward into the bases of Astralis. And the stopwatch from Perks was perfect as Copy pops the feathers to escape. Two kills to the good vitality to but no flash and no ult for 113. Nor for Finn. Copy does have the flash, but all he can put down are some feathers. Perks dashing forward here. Finn dodging away. Baron down to 2,000. 113, no way into the pit. The Baron, you have to feel, will be secured by Vitality. Bo with the smite takes it down. Jonghun looking for a flank position as Astralis continue to try and find a way TP into top. the fight. Leader TPing behind. Last breath onto one, but that allows Kaiser Bo and the rest of Vitality to escape. Yes, Perks is dead, but what's AP route, so everyone has to run for the hills from the upset. And we talked about it a little bit in draft. That paranoia doing so much work for Vitality means that leader cannot see the back line to shut them out. Dragon up, Baron remains on Vitality for a minute 50. It looks like Astralis may just push through mid, go top, see if they can get a tier two in this time, but Vitality have the Baron empowered recalls. We'll be able to get back to defend their base. A lickety split, and there is the Dragon going down. Two apiece now, but Vitality much more in command. That's good, <laughs> but I prefer Labracadabrador. Oh, okay. <laughs> Houndini is solid, though. Yeah, thank yeah, you. I like that. <laughs> Probably works better than the Houndini. Houndini? <laughs> anyway. <laughs> one, one, three, looking for a fight. As Photon dashes in. Q3 pulls back with the all out. Unstoppable with the Pathmaker and the rest of Vitality trying to collapse. Photon, though, still able to dodge away. The charm comes out, and this might be huge. As Charles find one, Boat pops the stopwatch. Upset trying to put the damage down from the side, but Finn's going to lock him up. Perks coming in as well with the Path Blossom, but Vitality are just way too deep. Tried to do too much and they pay for it in blood. Astralis, five of the Nord clean ace. They look defeated and now Astralis able to even out the gold scores. Two tier twos for them as well. And that was off Vitality's Baron push, remember. Gold that wave in, the rest of Astralis can react and back away. Paranoia coming out. Bo going very deep, dodges the Everfrost, but can't dodge the cast. And Bo almost falls with the Pop Blossom dodge by Colby with the feathers. 1-1-3 going forward with a Heartbreaker. And this is in a 4v5 as Charles trying to turn it back around. Both on locked up for the moment. They can't get themselves into position to threaten Baron at all. And you're never actually walking in blind as Astralis to anything that Vitality have to offer. There is one. How are you going to react, Vitality? Bo does have the Paranoia, but no vision in the pit to really spot anyone out. The Baron already taken. Bo pops the Paranoia, but it's just... Their current form, as you say, you'll be licking your lips pretty hungrily as any other team. Astralis now 1-4 split. Jonghun going forward, but a good double root from Perk stops the quickness. Oh. Keep your eyes on mid, though. Astralis away, yeah, as you say. Finn pushing in mid. Now going to start to move his way across. We'll be spotted on the control ward. Perks, Perks has the Pop Blossom. He's currently cosplaying his bow. There we are. Pop Blossom. Flash lands it onto it immediately. The shot.
shutdown comes out and that's the power of the Nico. Last breath in by Lida, but that's his last breath as well. John Hoon caught out with the paranoia. He's going to get chased away by Bo. And it's three for naught in favor of Vitality. Get up. You have the Lulu in pocket as well for those shields, the hell picks helping you out. And that will be a tier two over to Vitality. Even the Blinder Broth in down, but now Bo. Oh, Bo. Oh, Bo. Oh, oh. Bo. Oh, Bo, oh, Bo, oh, Bo. No, Bo. No, Bo. Look at this turret and Burks and Co. aware that they're just going to back away. I like that from Finn. You know, get the midway lane and start it up. That's going to melt. That's absolutely being shredded like a knife to butter. Bo goes in afterwards. Doesn't even land the fear. 1 1 3 going back forward. Bo pops the spell shield, but then finds the back line in the last breath. Comes in as well. Perk's going to pop the bottom. Pop Blossom, Lina trying to get onto Ward's upset, who will fall as well, and it's a shutdown for Astralis. Bo's able to take one in response, but all of Vitality are left by the wayside as Astralis clean them up. 1-1-3 one, one, on a rampage, Astralis on a rampage, Photon TPing to try and defend his base, but you have to feel he needs a few more electrons to defend this nucleus right now. Finn and 1-1-3 one, one, will continue to push in, and Astralis after what was a pretty disappointing early game have turned this game on his head. Finn managing to make the hero play at the end, sets up perfectly, Photon will go golden, but he will fall as this one comes through. Oh, Kaiser's Kaiser. here, there's a Gargoyles as well, I'm not sure he falls even to the last breath, and he's cleared out most of the minions, there's one cannon surviving, Photon's still alive, no one about to come off their death timers though. It was a valiant effort from Kaiser and Photon, but not enough as Astralis go two and three.